ones to avoid a lot of competition, which breeds cartels. Now, the Kenya National Union of Nurses has threatened to down their tools if their CBA is not signed and registered in court, and if nurses in 13 counties do not receive their salaries and allowances in seven days' time. In the meantime, the union has called on its members in the affected counties to hold demos outside the 13 county offices until their grievances are addressed. Following the crisis of the St. Mary's Mission Hospital in Nairobi's Langata area, nurses operating in private hospitals have also been urged to register with the union to have their rights protected as the body vows to defend their own in a legal suit against the sisters of assumption for evicting its health workers. 13 count governments have not honored the return to work formula. And these 13 count governments are one, Pungoma count government, Nakuru count government, Nyeri count government, Homa Bay count government, LK Maragwet, Darakanithi, Makweni County Government, Kakameka County Government, Wajir County Government, Laikipia County Government, Kirinyaka County Government, Muranga County Government, and Kericho County Government. We want to state categorically that the Kenya National Union of Nurses, as a consequence of the above, the union now issues a notice to the offending employers to pay all the nurses their outstanding dues immediately, and in any case, not later by close of business today. We also direct all our members through their branch officials who are owed money by the condemned county governments to prepare and start having daily salary parades at their respective governor's offices daily with immediate effect, with effect from 11 January 2018. We also wish to notify all the serving nurses in the country serving in any facility to see the urgent and the need of joining the nurses' union, both those who are working in the mission hospitals and private hospitals. In short, we are saying within 14 days, if the CPS is not signed and registered in court, the union is going to convene the National Governing Council to explain to them the progress that has taken place, and the National Government Council of the Union is going to give direction. And if the direction will be, we